Hello everyone. Today I want to show you my Cressla Ovata or my Jade Bonsai. Um, I got this tree back in July or August and since that time it's only grown about an inch but since I've repotted it about two to three months ago um, it's really just started to accelerate with being in a in its new pot and good soil and also I've been adding some fertilizer to to its waterings so it's been really liking that I'll give you a top view here you can see all the new leaves on the top including this little guy I also planted him in here. He just had a about three or four roots on him. This one's doing really good. It hasn't really grown much more, but the leaves have definitely broadened up on the top. And while we're down here, I'll show you the trunk. I'm um, here you can see we're starting to get some bark, I would believe, starting to form on our trunk down near the base and about halfway up and what I did at the same time when I repotted this I also took some limbs off of the trunk the front and the back and from up on this upper right limb here and I kept them all as as cuttings and planted them um, just in case I decided to do maybe some kind of a group planting in the future so I'll just show you these cuttings now okay so this is the first one and the largest cutting uh, this came from near the base of the trunk and you can see here that we've got some new growth um, this is probably growing about maybe a half an inch and I'll show you the next one here we are with the next one this is the second largest one Um, this one also had, you can see this little guy right here, he was also growing in between a couple of these leaves, but right down near the base. And I didn't want it dividing that close to the base, so I trimmed it off and I planted it here beside the cutting. I don't know if it's going to make it or not. We'll see what happens. I only planted that probably about maybe a week ago. So this cutting here also came from the trunk and I'll show you the next one. Here's the next one. It's not too much smaller and it hasn't grown quite as much as the other ones and this one is from the back side of the tree near the top of the trunk it hasn't grown as much but it's still doing good and doing better as the days go on and here's the smallest one and this little wee guy is uh, from up in the canopy of the tree and he hasn't grown much either, probably only about maybe a quarter inch. You can see he's got some new leaves down in the center there. It looks like they're just about to open up. And he's in just a little wee pot. 
until he gets bigger. Well, that's it for my jade tree and cuttings. And uh, I'm going to show you guys what I found the other day when I was in the secondhand store. Sometimes I'm in secondhand stores for various things around my house and my yard. Um, they're really great places if you guys are looking for stuff. Um, anything to do with gardening tools or larger flower pots and smaller flower pots. Whenever I'm in there, I always keep an eye out for these pots. They're not always in there, but once in a blue moon you'll see one. Um, I happened to get lucky the other day, and I seen this one there. And this is a medium-sized pot, I would say. It's a six and a half inch by five inch. And it's just in really, I would say, excellent condition. There's just not a scratch on it. And it even comes with a bottom tray that's in excellent condition. And I got both of these for $1.50. So, you know, you really can't go wrong. I have about three of these secondhand stores in the, the city that I live in and I'm not there all the time but I do go there once in a while and it's really interesting of the many things that you can come across and the prices that you can get items for so for me this is definitely a, a good deal well guys that's it for now have a great day